Next hunter up is a father-son combo, and this time the young son is going to be doing the hunting. And I mean, conditions could not be any better. I'm Gentry, and I'm from Dallas, Texas, and I'm here at the beautiful Texas Hidden Springs Ranch to hunt whitetail deer with my son, Gentry Jr. My name is Gentry Jr., and I'm so excited to be here at Hidden Springs Ranch hunting whitetail with my dad. I love hunting with my dad. Anytime I have the opportunity to get out of school, that's what we're doing, hunting. This place is absolutely beautiful. The topography uh, and terrain, the trees, and the weather couldn't be better for a hunt. We're really excited to be here. Good job, nice shot. I think those two were, were almost touching. Fantastic. You ready to get a big buck today? Yes, sir. Okay, great. Right, why don't we go back and get a sandwich and we'll head out to the blind. Let's do it. Let's Sounds do good. it. Looking forward to it. So we're going to go on inside now and have some lunch and then head on out to the blind and see if we can find that really mature buck we're looking for. There's no question about it. Deer's number one defense against hunters is his nose. He's going to smell you if uh, you don't do everything you can to minimize human odor. I don't think that you're going to be as successful a hunter. It's for that reason that our hunters, we encourage them, all of them, before you go out, spray down. We've got scent killer in the blinds. And what that is, is just literally, it's an insurance policy to keep that deer from smelling you. Here at Texas Hidden Springs Ranch, they have a lot of big deer. They're known for their big deer. But today, we're really looking for something that's a little more unique, something with some character, a mature buck. So we saw a lot of great deer, just not the one we were looking for, but it was an incredible hunt. Being outdoors with my son, Gentry, I mean, it just couldn't be any better for me. Wish I could do this every day of the week. So we're gonna head back to the camp, clean up, get a little bit of dinner, uh, enjoy ourselves this evening, get ready for a big hunt tomorrow. It's our last morning here at Hidden Springs Ranch. We'll see if GJ can get it done today. We saw a lot of incredible deer yesterday, but nothing that we, uh, we're gonna pull the trigger on, so hopefully Gentry can get it done. So we get out in the blind for the morning hunt, and as soon as the sun starts coming up, we are seeing lots and lots of deer. And there's one that we zero in on that really has some huge mass and incredible character. We think this is the one for Gentry. GJ, there's a good deer to take right there. That's a really nice man, so slowly, move slowly with the gun, okay? Take your time, take your time. Wait till that buck on the right. Let him clear, okay? Let the buck clear on the right. We're not in any rush, okay? You know exactly where the right shot placement is, okay? Okay, it's on you. Cheers. Great job, nice work. Yes. Fantastic. Yes. Good job. You got him. Look, 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 look. He's down. Nice work, nice work. Nice work. Good job, DJ. Proud of you. The perfect a shot. Perfect shot. You had a great <laughs> shot. Nice work, Gentry. I'm proud of you. It was a, it was a clean shot. The buck's down right over there. And uh, you, you, uh, you were very patient and uh, we, we appreciate it. Good job, really proud of you. Beautiful deer, beautiful hunt. What a great time here at Hidden Springs. Thank you. Good job, buddy. What an awesome, awesome hunt, Gentry. I'm so proud of you, you did a great job. You were so patient there. Tell me mm -hmm. a little about it. Well, there are two other uh, bucks in front of this one, and then finally they moved after a little bit, and I, uh, had the perfect shot, put it right in the shoulder. I'll tell you what, that shoulder shot you did, he didn't run very far. You put him down quickly. I'm really proud of you. That's what it's all about. Father and son, enjoying the outdoors at Hidden Springs. It just doesn't get any better. Coming up, 
Our next hunter is from Florida and Tim is a firefighter and he's never killed a big deer until now. This hunt taking place with Tim is going on in October. And so it's relatively early in the season. There's a lot of leaves still left on the trees and the acorns are just starting to hit the ground. It was 50 something degrees when I got out this morning. Two days ago, it was 95. 95. And so I knew something was gonna be happening. I mean, it's clear bluebird. I mean, cool. And I thought for sure y'all are gonna get a deer this morning, but I'd rather see one of these guys down than anything. I mean, one of the deals that we do out here is we let hunters kill all the coyotes, all the bobcats, any, all that kind of stuff they want free of charge. My hat's off to you, bud. Thank you. Thank Appreciate you. It. Welcome to the show. And uh, 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 I appreciate you wind up smoking a coyote. That's no fantastic. <laughs> My name is Tim. I'm from Central Florida, and I'm out here at Texas Hidden Springs Ranch. I'm looking for that big frame, typical chocolate horn Texas buck. So I was able to bring my wife out here with me. Uh, she knows it's something that uh, I've been wanting to do for a long time. Uh, I think we'll be able to enjoy this experience together and it'll be a, a, a memory for a long time for us. All right, so we just got out here for our afternoon hunt. Uh, we got a nice breeze blowing through here today. There's plenty of deer out here, some real good ones moving around. So hopefully we'll get on one this afternoon. comes running. That's a stud. Real pretty. I'd say he's in the 220s. He may be higher. Yeah. So it's still early in the sit and a real nice buck walks out, but I'm not quite ready to pull the trigger yet. I want to see what other type of bucks walk out. So we're sitting here watching and uh, get a couple more deer to walk out. And every single one of these deer, as they come out, they just keep getting bigger and bigger. So we're watching these other bucks, and I look over to the side, and there's a, a really big, typical frame chocolate horn buck that comes out. The one behind him in the woods, see it up in there? Looks like a mule deer. See him? Yeah, I got my eyes on him. He's real clean. He's got split brow tines, real chocolate horns. I think I'm gonna take this bug. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take him. Oh my gosh. Good shot. Good shot. Good. Can't even explain in words right now how I'm feeling. Uh, I've been hunting a long time, but I just got the chance to take the buck of a lifetime. I really want to get my hands on him and, and see him in person holding. What do you say? We'll look at him. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Holy cow, look at this buck right here. Look at these, these double brows right <laughs> here. Nice chocolate set of horns right here. And a sticker. A sticker on here. Another, another tine right here on this side. We've seen a lot of bucks out here and, and I knew when this guy stepped out that he was the one I wanted to take. Man, I just can't thank you guys enough, Keith Warren and, and all you guys. Well, we, our and pleasure, our it's, pleasure. It's been an awesome experience. The, the, the guides have been great, the food's been great. If, if anybody gets a chance to come out here, I highly recommend Texas Hidden Springs Ranch. Well, let's get back and weigh him and uh, get him in the cooler. All right, sounds good. Good job, buddy. Thanks. So this, is, this whole experience has been a, a, a phenomenal experience. A really big adrenaline rush. I was able to have my wife here with me to experience it all. It's a, it's a time that we'll remember for the rest of our lives. The, the level of service here is top notch from the guides to the food and to the exceptional deer hunting that's out here. And I'm looking forward to, to coming back next year. This deer season is just shaping up to be so good. We knew it was going to. Back in the summertime, we had all these Reconyx pictures, thousands of pictures of lots and lots and lots of big, pretty deer because our plan, our management plan that we put together over 20 years ago is now reality. And every hunter that comes out here sees it over and over and over again. And it's my job to make sure that we deliver more than what we say we're gonna deliver every single time and that's what we do with our hunters that come out here is for that reason we don't take that many hunts and the reason why is because we want to make sure that every hunt is perfect that it can't be any better 
and ask any of the hunters that have been here, they'll tell you that they have had a wonderful time and the deer are phenomenal. My name is Keith Warren and you've been watching The High Road. And if you wanna come out here and hunt with me, I'd love to talk to you about it. Head on over to our website at texashiddenspringsranch.com. It'll answer all the questions you've got and it'll give you my telephone number. Call me up and we'll get you out here next season. Thanks for watching. Taxidermy work for the High Road Group is provided by Conroe Taxidermy, Conroe, Texas.